Are you recording me? Yes. Welcome to another video. I wanted to share with you guys something really cool that my husband did today. He traded his old Dodge pickup truck for um, a project for us to work on together. And I'm really excited and we're gonna um, share the whole journey with you guys. So you wanna tell them? Slow journey. Oh, slow journey, yeah. You wanna tell them anything? No, I'll just show them. <laughs> Man, a few words. All right, so. This is a 1962, 1962, I almost said 72, 1962 Chevy Nova. Two. Two. <laughs> I didn't know there was a two, but this is what it looks like on the outside. It is currently pretty much a rust bucket, but it is. It's not a rust bucket. <laughs> I know. It is, uh, it's definitely a, a hidden gem. Like, honestly, I think it's absolutely beautiful, and I'm super stoked about restoring this with my husband like this is gonna be fantastic I'm, so it has a lot of rust right here but we got some stuff today at o'reilly's to get that oh, off yeah. <laughs> Riley's, yeah me, and this me. is the other side of it oh, me. Me. it's really really cool i mean look how cool like this ancient <laughs> yes, cat is. Oil. So what? it is a four door. My husband would rather have had a two door, but four door is fine. I, I told him the extra windows. So right now, the door does not actually latch. He thinks I broke it, <laughs> but I, I do a lot of stuff. I break Novas. I did that to our old Nova too. Well, I didn't break the door. I just blew it up. All right. So right now we currently have a stop sign on the floor because <laughs> that's what's going on so I just it's extra ventilation for your yeah. feet yeah we can breathe a little bit um cute little cup holder <laughs> so this side has a mirror i don't know if you guys noticed but that side does not have a mirror all right here is the seats they are a little dingy but you guys know i love this color <laughs> but i don't think we're going to keep it this color um there's like three different colors on that thing it's going to need um definitely oh, needs ow. speakers on the door panel the door panel. Okay, that's good. Um, and then uh, the speedometer doesn't work. This is the whole thing right here. It's funny. And then over here, oh, over here, this is what the handle thing is. What is that called? The gear, shifter. gear shifter. Thank gear you. Selector. Gear selector. So yeah, that doesn't work. Does, do you know if the gas yeah, the works? The Fuel works. works? Okay, that's nice and rusty. No, no horn. But I absolutely love the old fashioned steering wheel. <laughs> I think it's really cool. Um, doesn't have a radio yet. This thing we're going to be replacing definitely. Um, but yeah, there's. And here is the. It's such a cute little thing. All right, so here is the roof. The roof the roof of it is very very rusty Woo! it's not very rusty okay it's, it's not just very rusty. Surface. it's just surface rust it's it's, it's just it's okay it's so we've got a new radiator um came with it also came with a v8 oh it came with a v8 as well but the car has a v6 or an no, inline six right now okay so it has an inline six right now my husband has to walk with the cane right now still because he entered his ankle at work the other day all right so this is the back door this actually opens really nice compared to the other doors so we're definitely going to be replacing all of this and um i don't know if you guys saw this either but on both sides the passenger side as well those little mini windows are what wing wing windows wing windows are so we can't open them right now. kind of broken so we cannot open these no we can open right? these we can 
they're open right oh, now. Oh, these, the wings, oh, they wing open. Oh, okay, I know what you're talking about now. Okay, yeah, they open. Sorry. I'm trying, you guys, I'm trying. So, this is all, I think that's just surface rest also. Check it out, Ashby's in a car. <laughs> in a back seat, One what? For each person. Wow. Yep, because our kids are big smokers. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, and then you guys, look how beautiful this is. Oh, there's a hole. That's what lovely. Mommy? What the mommy? Yeah, hi, Riley. Say hi. Hi. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah but you're in the car? I think this is going to be so much fun. This That side actually looks a lot neater, a lot cleaner. But back you here, know? there's... Uh, yeah, the seats need to be replaced and everything. I am super stoked, you guys. And <laughs> that is bungee shut. Um, so that's nice. That's nice. <laughs> that's nice. <laughs> Can you open it? I think. All right. So. Oh, I'll just leave that one on. Oh, it came with some tools. Oh, it came with some tools. Hey. Oh, look. Little freebies. Look, babe. What? Oh, my gosh. There, oh, there's the. No mirrors, but. <laughs> yeah. oh, this is the original radio bevel thing. Oh, that's cool. And a thing. And a thing. <laughs> oh, here's but, the one. Oh, jeez. Oh, All right, so there's that. Oh. There. Oh. Okay, with a tachometer. I was gonna let him say that because I had no idea what it was oh, called. There's something dormant. It's just a whole bunch of garbage. Oh, okay. Okay, so we gotta obviously do something for back there, right? Yeah, Look at that. A little yes. rhino liner or something. Oh, yes, I love Buy the carpet kit. Rhino liner is amazing, you guys. Well, and then we're gonna buy the carpet kit. Oh. Yeah, that'll be good. Do it up right. Well, hey, actually, if we, don't we, if we just put rhino liner on here and not put in carpet in there, it'd be perfect for taking it to the beach. And then if anything gets sandy, we can easily clean it out. Oh, no. You can take the carpet out. Oh, okay. Sounds good. All right, so do the rear lights work? Yes. The rear lights work. Fantastic. All right. Yeah, that's that. So that is super cool, you guys. Oh, look at the wheels, the tires. Super ancient. I am so excited to work on this with him. I seriously am, you guys. I've always wanted to work on a classic car and I'm so stoked. Oh, it's in, I live in Washington and it rains a lot, so we have to get new windshield wipers very soon. Um, let me show you the engine in the motor area. So we are gonna be replacing this with a better one. Um, the, uh, the engine? Yeah. engine. It's in the back. You can walk. Over <laughs> you got me all confused. You got me worried. You can walk. It's in the back of the truck. If you oh yeah, I'll show that to you guys as well. But yeah, here is this. It's just way more simple back then. You look at this. Like you open my Honda and there's like yeah, you cannot see. It, oh, I'm gonna do it again. You can't see nice. the ground if you look in my Honda's trunk. This no, hood. Here. Sorry, hood. <laughs> but back here, 1962 is so simple, you guys. I love American-made cars. This is just blocking the battery terminal. Oh, okay. It's too big of a battery. Like oh, okay. So he had to put that in there. And I'm going to show you guys the new and All right, you guys. This is pretty massive. This will fit? Yeah. Okay, this will fit, you guys. So this is a Chevy 307, my husband told me. V8. He didn't, and V8, yeah. He didn't want me to sound stupid, so he told Instead me before I pressed it. We don't need that much power. That's really cool. I mean, it's so big. It'll sound mean. I like that. I but want the person painted it with regular paint instead of heat resistant. That's why it's bubbling. So, so I had to scrape all that off. Okay. Uh, repaint it. Repaint it? What are you going to install on it? That's going to be so fun, you guys. I am really excited. He has a cherry picker and everything for it. My husband has so many nice tools. My poor husband. Poor guy. That is our beautiful new project, you guys. I hope you enjoyed seeing all of this. Do that right now? Yeah, and add to that way they get excited about seeing a renovation. All right, so we really don't know what we're doing, if it's going to work right or not, but we got this stuff right here. Meguiar's mm -hmm. mirror glaze professional medium cut cleaner one. I don't know if that any, means anything, but we got this and we also got this steel four, wool. Four aught. What is it? It's called four aught. It's the finest. Four aught. 
Oh, it means zero. Oh, I didn't, I had no idea. All right, so we were going to use Coca-Cola, but we're like, let's just get the good stuff. <laughs> just we'll tell them what we're doing so they know. All right, all. so we are going to be trying to get this off real quick and I'm going to show you. So yeah, this is our first video on trying to restore this beautiful gem. It's been four weeks since you called and I've been waiting here for you all along. I've been waiting here for you all along. Did you go? I wonder if you found what you're looking for. Wonder if you found what you're looking for. All right, so this is basically as good as we could get it. Some of the rust could not come off. I think we're gonna definitely have to sand it because, oops, because the rust was on here a little too long and now it's all bubbly looking. So this is the stuff we used and um, it did not take all of it off. It was a little hard to do. Some of the stuff is stuck on and it's just gonna be really hard. We are gonna have to take a sander to it because some of the rust was on here for way too long. Um, we're gonna try dot too hot. Too hot, we're gonna try too hot for the... Um, well, I mean, if you got something, if, they, if your viewers got something like this, yeah. start with two hot instead of four. If you have something like this, try the two hot instead of the four hot. You and then follow about. that up with the four out. And then follow it up with the four out, he says. So, Maybe. so yeah, we'll see. <laughs> We're going to give it a try. But, I mean, it took off the brown, most of the brown rust pretty good. Um, now we just have a lot more to do. But we definitely want to take you guys along with this because I think it'd be a really fun thing to do. And because some of you guys are maybe interested in cars. And, and yeah, I don't know. I've always been interested in this. And I've always wanted to... Uh, restore a car so a classic preferably my favorite though is the mustang firebird not my Mustang, mustang firebird did i just seriously say that you did. oh my gosh I mustang fastback you guys fastback I, I i know i like pontiac firebirds too but my favorite Hello, classic see. car is the mustang fastback so always want to do that maybe someday i will but until then we are going to work on this beautiful gem all right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more to come. I hope you guys enjoy this journey. We're going to be bringing you guys along. And here come some subwoofers. Here come some subwoofers from our neighbor. Right, well, that's good. <laughs> All right, give us a like and subscribe. And yeah, we'll give you more videos to show. And hopefully you guys enjoy this process. All right, thank you guys for watching. Bye now. Bye now. Bye now. All the limits with you right now. So, what you feel, things?